Um, what I find interesting about his work is that it's made of these crap things and suddenly it comes to life. So it has a human aspect in it. The session is there. Yeah, <coughs> that is a basic anarchic uh, mm -hmm. idea. Mm -hmm. And with this he, he brings it into the art world. Right. But when, when anybody can have an artwork and by creating it itself, mm -hmm. there is no more art market, there is no more possession of yeah. artworks and things like that. And okay. so that is one very important character trait of his own anarchic right. theory. It's almost as though Henry renders the viewer as the most uncreative part of it. He kind of destroys the creation of it in, in the actual art making process. Meta means above or beyond, and matic means willing. So what Tangley built was something that was above and beyond the willing. The choice of the colour, the, the, the machine itself, um, the choice of the duration, how long this, this felt pen draws, and, and everything else, that's not random, that's the, these are decisions. Mm. It's decisions by Tangley, it's decisions by the, by the machine, because it, it is built, it has a shape and it's a decision by, by the user. It seems in light of what we have discussed about Tang Lee's drawing machines in particular that they had parameters so it would, I mean, in a way, you know, kind mm -hmm. of echo that. Mm -hmm. Well, you have oh, right. this. <laughs> 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 Look at that. Now you have this participation, you have process and you have analyzation of art mm -hmm. and in that again is also the analyzation or critique of the role of the artist, the mm -hmm. role of the beholder or the role of the artwork. Okay. So then you have everything in it.